Hi, welcome to another Project HBC tutorial. Today we're going to be dealing with time remapping in Premiere Pro. First thing I want to do is head over to the Premiere window and click the Window tab, then click on Workspace and ensure you're using Edit in CS 5.5. That way we've both got the same layout. All right. So what I've done here is imported a clip of me jumping off a quarry ledge. Um, we're going to slow that down and try and make it look a wee bit more like an action shot. Okay, so what I'm using is uh, 120 frames per second GoPro footage, so that's going to give me a, a 2 to 1 ratio on a 60 frames a second sequence, um, which is the maximum Premiere allows. So what we're going to do is remap that down so we've got a bit of an action shot. So this is what it looks like straight away. Okay, so that's real time. So next thing we do is up to the effect controls here. See the time remapping. If you open that arrow up, open up the speed. And then we find the position that we want to start our time remapping, which is when I'm just about to jump off the ledge. Okay, so we'll take that there. Right here. And drop a keyframe there. And we find the spot that we want to restart the footage time, which is around here well we'll say just as I'm in the water okay let me drop another keyframe so what we're going to do now is go down to the timeline here click on this little arrow click on time remapping and speed Now, as you see this white, this yellow line here, you can drag that down and that's going to pull down the, the speed of the clip. And as you pull the speed of the clip down, these keyframes are going to get wider apart. And that's just a time varying um, effect. So let's pull it down to about 40%. 40, 40 and render that out and have a look at see how that is. So just push enter to render that and as you'll see the red line above the timeline is just turned green. Okay, so here we go. Yep, it's quite good but it's not slow enough I don't think for the, the effect we're looking for. Okay, so we'll just drag that down a wee bit further. You can drag that down here on the timeline or up here at the effects. So take that down to about 20%. Now if you look up here at the, the effect controls, you've also got these keyframe things here. You can stretch them out and that gives you the ramp, that gives you a bit of a gradient on your speed. So you're not going to be um you're not going to be just straight into slow motion and then straight back out again, which could look a bit odd. So that's going to ramp it from 20% back up to the 100% and you can see the, the kind of ramp it's going to be. So let's just render that out by pressing enter and see how that looks. Okay. That is much more like what we needed. And then back up to full speed. So as you, as you can see these keyframes are adjustable and the ramps are adjustable and obviously you can adjust the speed here on the timeline and you can adjust it up here in the effect controls window also. So that's been time remapping within Premiere Pro. Stay tuned.